Hello, everyone. This is the most intelligent and magnificent bird, Buckbeak, speaking to you today. And in today's video, I am going to be doing another Rating With Me video. And before we get started, I hope all of you are doing good and staying safe out there. I'm doing good and I'm staying safe for the most part. And the $10 Google Play Store card giveaway is underway. If any of you guys are interested in entering that giveaway, just check the description down below for all of the info and requirements in order to join the giveaway. I don't really have a number set of um, raid milestones I'm going to stop at. I'm just going to stop whenever I want to stop. And um, and today I'm going to be um, raiding with two different teams. Both of them are very similar, but they're both different as well. And as you guys can see, I have already started raiding just a little bit. And I'm just going to raid with these two different attack teams. So I think I'm going to go ahead and get started, shall we? Just going to attack with my normal, um, you know, raid with my normal attack team like I normally do. It doesn't look like the new um, arenas uh, have come in this week into the game just yet. I'm definitely, um, when those new arenas come into the game, I'm definitely going to do, you know, I'm going to do a video on every new one probably each week once that, you know, once the, those new ones come come into the game.
since the um, new arenas have not come into the game yet, I'll definitely have a friendly duels um, video coming out for you guys um, sometime this week. So just um, be on the lookout for that. I might even have another rating with me video out for you guys this week as well after this. We'll see how the week, you know, we'll see how the week goes. So for the remainder of this week, will definitely be at least one Friendly Duels video, um, two character review videos, and when we get um, info on the next um, Mythic Battle Pass, those are definitely happening this week, so just be on the lookout for all of that. Now... I want to say Clem has Uncle Sam. This might be a completely different... Ooh, okay, yeah. I don't know how well I'm going to do against this team here. Yeah, Uncle Sam in there, but I notice Zachary's in there, so I don't know. Like, Yeah, all that's... I don't think I'm going to last all that long at all. I have not really faced a Zachary before today, so... <laughs> We'll see how well, yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to outlive that. No way, like, no, not going to happen. Yeah, 21,000 bleed, yeah. There's not a whole lot of teams, realistically, that could survive that, so I'm not ashamed of that. Oh, no, we just lost. No, thank you. I have never really experienced Zachary on a team before today, before today, so, yeah, I see he's an even bigger pain in the butt than Uncle Sam, to, in my opinion, definitely. Okay, this is, uh, I'm gonna actually try out my second team here, let me find that team here. Um, you know what? I think it's not going to be this team. I obviously have to change some things on this team right quick. Let me put Negan in there. Uh, going to put Yumiko. I'm going to put, um, Waylon. Uh, Maribel. And then, um, then I'm going to put, uh, Aaron. Yeah, that's who I had in there for this team. Let's see, I'm going to give him that weapon, I'm going to give Yumiko my double attack um, rampage weapon, and right here, as you guys can notice, I ended up get, uh, crafting another double attack weapon, plus crit up, so I'm just hoping to get another rampage weapon, you know, because that would be really nice, obviously, but that's, like, really hard to get. So, this is my a second attack team that I've kind of been um, building and just testing out. And so far, I'm surprised. It works. It works. I can, I can get those crits off, but not, I mean, not all the time, obviously. But as I test this team out, you guys are going to see how well this can work pretty good. It's not 100% of the time it's going to work, but it definitely works for sure. Let's try it. might work now. There we go. You know what, um, one thing that gold mythic, um, yellow tunes are lacking, um, is an attack leader. That's one thing that they're lacking that hopefully, um, comes into the game soon enough. 
But I don't know, this whole Skybound X stuff is, you know, what they want to push right now. And by the way, this is the last time and the last video that you guys are going to hear me even bring up the whole Skybound X thing ever again. I just think it's it, it, it's ridiculous. It, it's over the top. I mean, I know zombies aren't realistic. I get that. And me, myself, I love space entertainment. You know, I love the original trilogy of Star Wars. Um, I even like some of the prequels. I like Mass Effect as well, because I have mentioned Mass Effect a couple of times on a couple of my raid videos, but The Walking Dead and just the whole idea of space, it just, it, it, it's, it's terrible. It looks terrible. So, yeah, this is going to be the last video that you guys ever hear me talk about the Skybound X uh, related anything. I just think it's a horrible idea and I'll just, I'll be so glad when it's over with so we can move on to another allegiance. Maybe the Knight's Allegiance. I think that could be a pretty good allegiance to move to next. You know, I even like the um, the that Star Wars game uh, that came out a couple of years ago. Um, Star Wars uh, Jedi Fallen Order. Yeah, Star Wars Jedi um, Fallen Order. That was a really, really good game. So, yeah, I'm not against space entertainment. It's just when it mixes in with something like The Walking Dead is where I have a problem with it personally. And so far, the two Skybound X characters are just not even really that amazing. So, I mean, maybe they'll get better going forward. Maybe they'll end up getting worse. I mean, who knows? But, yeah, that's pretty much the last thing I have to say about the whole Skybound X stuff. Let's see if we can have Yumiko really go off with the double attack and rampage. That'd be awesome. Ooh, nice. Okay. I think you guys have seen her go off with um, with the double attack rampage in the friendly duels video I made last. That I well, I didn't make it last week. I uploaded it last. Um, I want to say this past Saturday. I think it was. I uploaded that particular video the friendly duels and I think she did pretty nice in that video I'm gonna switch back to the other team after this one kind of just switch back and forth Come on, please stun Negan. Come on, Waylon, you can do it. Ugh. Well, he won't do too much because he's got a guardian shield there. So. Nice. Thank you, Yumiko. <laughs> Although, I think Maribel could be really great. So far, I think Yumiko is just uh, slight, slightly better. Uh, Yumiko is slightly better than Maribel 
in my opinion, because I do have um, Yumiko leveled up a little bit more, plus I have her limit broken, so... Okay, um... Ooh, is Connor about to go off? Yup. He looks really cool. I, I definitely want to get Connor one of these days. For sure. It might even be worth um, limit breaking Connor as well. Hmm... I don't think I'm going to win this one, obviously, at this point. But you never know. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know. Does one of them have AP down? Yeah, I think it's Glenn. Ah, that, that Glenn. That damn Glenn. Yeah, I can... I don't, yeah. Yeah, hold on. I can do that one. Wait a minute. That one shouldn't be hard. Hold up. Watch, the very next turn, you know, this turn being that very next turn, I'll end up getting it. That, that's how it usually works. It's like, it's really dumb. Like, sometimes, every once in a while, you'll lose to a team that you should be able to beat. Then, if you try it again the very next turn, you'll get it. Like, it just happens sometimes. See, I, I feel confident already that I already got this. You know, the governor is going to do a big bulk of that damage. Obviously, because of the outlast. But that's to be expected at this point. Unless you have him stunned, like I just did, and that won't happen. But usually, as you guys can see, if I have my full team, or, I, or if I have at least four members still alive, and the governor goes off, I can usually, you know, win them and stay up, even if he does most of the damage. Look at that. Look how nice. Ah, uh, Andrea, you... That's alright. I got something for you. See? See, I told you I had something for you. Okay. Ooh, nice. Maybe I should have took care of Andrea. Probably, yep. <laughs> That's alright, I got it. No problemo. Maybe I should have left the governor until last. I probably should have. Well, wow, he didn't even do that much that time. Usually, he usually does a lot. Nice. Oh no, you still got Zachary. <laughs> That's not happening. The Uncle Sam stuff, you know, I could deal with that, but ugh. That Zachary. There's no way. Like, 99, I, I would, 
Honestly, I would say 100% of the teams that come up against that team with Zachary, I uh, just cannot let, can just not last long at all. It like took me two turns and I was like done. <laughs> Alrighty, we're gonna switch back to my other team here. Obviously, I need to go ahead and get rid of him before uh, Tyrese can like. Literally one shot Mirabel or Yumiko. Let's see if she can do anything on the second turn. Uh, a little something. Nice. Too bad she didn't get the Guardians to go off. Mm. I didn't even see Gator over there. He was hiding in the corner. I have to say, I just did not see him hiding over there in the corner. Because I was wondering who took out Mirabelle in one hit. And then I see the yellow symbol pop up, you know, above her head. And I was like, oh, Gator, okay. Thank goodness she can't even go off because she's confused. And that doesn't matter because we took care of her. And uh, to this week, uh, especially today, I have made uh, Diamond 3 in the leagues um, for the first time ever. So... No matter what place I end up, this, you know, going into next week, because the end of the current league season is getting ready to come to an end, um, I will definitely get 700 coins, you know, guaranteed just from that alone. And for those that don't know, I, you know, I have the 30 day coin pass. You know, it's it's not that much. It's at a pretty reasonable price. And here's the thing with the coins. You know, I have about fif uh, 15. Um, hold up. No, uh, 16. I have over 16,500 coins. And if you can learn to save your coins, no matter... You know, no matter if you go through the Tap Joy offers or buy the 30 day pass, you have to learn how to save those coins. And I would highly recommend um, saving your coins for future step up recruit wheels in the future. That's exactly what I'm doing. I believe you need 30. 36, uh, 36, 38,000 coins to successfully pull everything off of a step up, uh, step up recruits wheel, and that's exactly what I'm doing right now. Or, unless there's a, uh, event coming up that, you know, you that you have to spend coins to get a character or whatever that you th might think is worth it. I would, I guess, it, but that's entirely up to you. I'm only highly suggesting, uh, no matter how you get your coins, yeah, save them and build them up to at least get 36 to 38,000 coins for a future step up. Uh, recruits will that's exactly what I'm going to do I was planning on doing that until the uh, we want you event came along and the characters in there for me were like okay they were good enough for me to go ahead and spend a little bit of coins but at the end of that event I had over 12,000 coins I believe and obviously, as you guys, as I showed you guys, I'm up to over 16,000 coins within the last, 
uh, two weeks that that event had happened about two weeks ago. So I thought it was a, a an event that was really worth spending some coins on. And I was able to get two Sandies out of it. And I was able to finally limit break my current Sandy. And I have an extra Sandy that I can do a second limit break to when that eventually comes around. So I thought that event was worthwhile spending the coins on personally because I had so many. And I'm back to around uh, what I had before I spent on that event. Maybe more. I would have to look, though, back and see what I had before I started participating in the We Want You event. I have my um, Darius right now currently at tier 4, and right now I'm not really going to progress to go after that second Darius uh, just yet. Uh, maybe if I get him from training grounds, or if I can get him from the gold mythic pools, then I'll tier 5 him. If I don't, I'm just going to wait for that Knight's Allegiance, you know, Mythic Trials Knight's Allegiance to actually be a thing in the game. And when that happens, and I don't have that second Darius by then, then I'll get him from the gold medals and stuff like that. So yeah, my current Darius, um, as you can see right yeah, right, right there. He's just going to sit at um, tier four for the time for the for the time being. So, just until the uh, Mythic Trials um, Knights Allegiance is a reality. I was going to go after Herschel as well, but then I was able to get a second cap. And I was like, well, there's no need to go after Herschel then, because I already got, you know, I already got two cows just waiting on the Mythic Trials to start and become a reality before I realistically go after a second Darius, so. And probably by then, I'll probably have enough gold medals to pick up a second Darius if I have to pick him up from the uh, pick him up from the museum. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to do another six and then I'm going to call it after that. I'm going to do three with this attack team and the other three with my normal attack team. So here we go, I gotta take care of that pesky Tyrese before he becomes a problem on this team. Ooh. Uh, okay.
I know this video has got to be at least 25 minutes at this point. But that's so right though. I love making just I love making these any of these videos for you guys. So it's not a problem about the length, but you know, my uh my camera might have other plans. I mean, it doesn't happen all the time, but it has happened especially back in March when I ha during my uh I think it was March or April of this year when my when I had to uh, make three different parts of my monthly pools that particular month like I said it doesn't happen all that often so yeah just gonna do the remaining four yeah the remaining four and then I'm gonna call it Ooh. Carl well Never mind, we're good to go. Maybe Yumiko could surprise me here? No? Yeah, guys, it looks like my camera is currently running out of space any second, so I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go now. I am Buckbeak, and I'm going to go fly away back to my nest. Until next time, bye, guys.